Hi Taurus, it's Jo from Angels and Ancestors and darling, I'm introducing a new reading to the channel. It's a quick fire reading. I don't know what I'm calling it yet. I don't know whether to call it a check-in, an energy reading or a quick fire reading, but you get the drift. It is a quick reading. It's for a weekly reading. It's from the 8th to the 14th of March this week. We are using the uh, Sacred Rebel deck to get your weekly energy and then we will turn to the good tarot for the actual reading so darlings let's just get an energy for you for the week what cards fall full there will be no clarifiers legacy of light this is to do with generations this is a light that is passed down from spirit to mother to child. So my darlings, be the hunter, not the hunted, Taurus. So whatever it is that you're thinking of doing, do not allow somebody else to make you feel that you're not in control of what it is that you're trying to shine a light on. The ten of air. There has been issues and problems around you that you have now resolved. They are coming to a conclusion and you are using those issues and problems now in order to protect yourself. You know how to deal with them so if they rear their heads again, you are absolutely capable of dealing with these. Um, it's also about letting go of those issues and starting again by cutting out the bullshit and the bollocks um, and starting with a new deck to allow your new thoughts, feelings and seeds to grow, darlings. You've got the three of water. This is celebrations between friends, family and community. And it's learning to go with the flow of things, especially around celebrations. You've got the ace of water. There's a brand new beginning coming in for self. Now, when you get the seahorse, it's a magical little creature. It is the male that holds on to the egg and breeds new life into something. And that's what I'm getting for you. There is going to be new life breathed into some area of your life where you are going to uncover this light. Make this light shine for you. Make this light shine for you. Make things work for you. But there is a temptation just ahead. Now, it could be that it is a good temptation. Somebody may be dangling a carrot. If your intuition, which is telling me your intuition is massively high at the moment. If your intuition and the light shines on it and says that it is a good bet, go for it. If your intuition, if that initial gut feeling before you've had time to think about it, tells you don't do it don't go there don't do it but there's an opportunity coming up for celebrations a new beginning and for you to actually lay things to rest so lovelies that is your reading for this week i will catch you very soon take care for now bye bye